Welcome back, gang, for the first time and hopefully many more to come. Don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel and click on the notifications right here, this little bell, so you can get those emails every time we go live. Peace. A good one. So, Billy Joe Saunders is actually fighting Martin Murray. I'm not happy at all. I'm no. happy for Saunders that he's... He's 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 willing to fight whoever to stay active, but Murray is past this prime, and Murray's a common opponent, and 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 Billy Joe isn't a puncher, so why do that to yourself? Why get in there with a guy that didn't Lemieux even fight Murray too, or no? I don't know about that. Well, Murray fought Murray fought Rosado, who fought Lemieux, and Murray fought. Triple G, who fought Canelo and everyone else. So for 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 Billy Joe, I guess the only way to come out on top is another David Lemieux like performance, because he ain't knocking his guy out. Maybe he's that faded. Potentially, you know, maybe that's a factor. Um, Murray is durable as fuck, bro. But uh, agreed. Um, I would assume he's able to outbox him. Martin Murray's not a good boxer. Martin Murray's a very basic, come forward, high guard, European, stereotypical boxer. Um, Billy Joe Saunders is the exact antithesis of that. I would assume that Billy Joe Saunders is able to outbox him every second of the fight. Martin Murray is not to the level of ability that even a David Lemieux is. Um, I think this is purely a stay busy fight. I think this is a, a huge back step, in my opinion, in terms of competition. Um, it's a domestic fight to keep busy, maybe get some asses in the seats, make a little tiny paycheck and wait to see what happens in May. I, so, I understand why I don't like it. I wish he fought somebody better, somebody a little more, I don't know, current, relevant, anyone almost better than this. So do you explain it to our listeners that are not understanding why Billy Joe Saunders basically fights what looks like on HBO mm -hmm. and is in fighting a now available Demetrius Andre, Jamal Charlo, Daniel Jacobs, Louis DeCubas Aries. Well, Kuba Aris obviously just had a loss, and I think, let's be honest, um, he was unknown until that fight with Daniel Jacobs. He became somebody because of Daniel Jacobs. Uh, I have not heard it from him since that fight, so I I don't, I would not have liked the Lewis Aries fight, just to be honest. But, but would you like it any, no, any less? Fight. Would you like it any less? Because are you saying you like Murray more than Lewis? I think it's one of those where I I don't care about either. I, I'll put it that way. Like, I, I don't even want to yeah, get... I think it's time moment. where, you know... I um, mean, I hear you. It's a rabbit hole, but go ahead. Very quickly, I just think that both fights are pointless. So there's really no debating which one's more pointless. Because I, pointless. Think that, I think that it is worth it, right? Because you see, uh, a guy like Martin Murray, Billy Joe gets credit for him due to resume and who he's been in the ring with. So in retrospect, you look at it and it's like, oh, Martin Murray. Yeah, he's been in there with this guy and that guy. He was in there with Sturm. He was in there with Gennady. He was in there with, with Macklin. You know, Martin Murray's a adorable name, but he's also past his prime. I think that if Billy Joe were to get in there with Lewis, not to say that I'm beating the drum for Lewis, just saying at least he's not past his prime. At least it's a guy that's still trying to win, whereas a guy that versus a guy that's trying to make a paycheck off his name. That's all I'm saying. But it is what it is. We touched on uh, Billy Joe. I, 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 want, I want to get to your actual question because we, we delve into a rabbit hole off of the question that was not pertaining to the question that you the, yeah, that you actually asked. Why he is not fighting the Charlos, the, the Jacobs, the Andras. Obviously, Jacobs and Andrade are on HBO. Okay, Dervichenko is also, you know, available. Yes. Um. Obviously, Jacobs and Gerard are on HBO, so network affiliation is not the issue there. My opinion, I have no information, just my opinion, Jacobs versus Andrade is probably going to happen next. That's why we're not getting Billy Joe Saunders against one of those guys. The reason why we're not getting Charlo against 
Billy Joe Saunders is the obvious HBO versus Showtime issue. These are two networks that do not like working together. They only work together when they have to. Um, and this is not a particular fight where they have to work together. So that's why you're not going to get a Jamal Charlie Billy Joe Saunders fight at this point in time. Not saying that if Billy Joe Saunders and Jamal Charlo continue to win and the final two guys in the division, yeah, HBO and Showtime may work together then. But at this point, no, that is that is not the case. Um, I forget who else you mentioned, but I, th- I think I pretty much answered as to why that is the reason we're getting this fight. Plus, domestic level money. I know that is something that we may not understand in the U.S., me and you, Ness, the listeners here, that are majority from the United States for this show, but this fight's going to make money in the U.K. Martin Murray's, like you said, known. He's fought everyone. He is 100% known in the boxing community. Billy Joe Saunders right now is definitely a hot brand and commodity. I think they're capitalizing off of this peak moment for Billy Joe Saunders with a domestic sort of money grab with a known guy, Martin Murray. I, I understand why it's happening. I think money makes sense, financially makes sense. And right now, the, the layout, layout of the division sort of deems a step back, period. I just would not like to a step back this much, but it is what it is. Martin Murray is about eight years older, almost 10 years older than uh, Billy Joe. I'm not surprised. Billy Joe Saunders is in his 20s still, I believe, right? And he's coming off of three wins. Mm -hmm. Two of those are people we've never heard of, but at least one was undefeated. Murray was deducted a point, though, in round 12 for leading with his head. In the Rosado fight, which people thought he lost, and then another dude we never heard of, so. Fucking boxing, bro. You just got to stick around long enough to get your shot. And you you got to always work, right? Because, like, shout out to Caleb Truax. He made it happen. Like, this is Martin Murray's opportunity to beat Caleb Truax. Can he make it happen? We all will count him out. And, uh, you know, he's got to make us kind of swallow uh, our pride <laughs> if he's right. What is up, TBV family? Yes, yes, YouTube has been cutting funding to uh, their channels as of late and with net neutrality uh, going through its process. The internet is changing. If you want to keep your favorite channel intact, coming up with tons of content, and plus get hours and hours of extra content, head over to patreon.com forward slash the boxing voice to become a member of the TBV family and help support the channel. Peace.